Hello everyone, my name is Alexander Mendes and today I'm going to show you how to see workflow configuration for MDM. These steps here apply for any master data management version. So the agenda for the video is I'm going to basically show you a demo how to gather the MDM workflow configuration. It consists basically in retrieve data information from C Hapus CO underscore CS underscore config table. It's very useful because it helps you to troubleshooting issues like the task assignment failing in IDD application. It might fail with an error message like this one. Uh, if you name taste task data type task type cannot be new or empty okay let me show you okay in this example here i'm going to use a third party tool in this case here is a uh, this <coughs> client here the oracle sql developer this is the version that i'm using uh, but I, I have just connected here with the uh, MDM sample user. It's the owner of the ORS, the sample ORS. And I'm going to run a select start from C, repos, CO, CS, config table. Okay, this is the table that holds the, the information that I said, the workflow information. Okay. Okay, as you can see here, it returned some rows. Uh, the important one for the example that I said, uh, when you have a, like a task assignment in IDD failing, is this one here, the tasks. So you select this line, the config type, equals tasks then you have this blob information binary large object information in the in config data column so <clears throat> over here what you do is that you double click it it opens this pencil here then you can view it as any as an image or as a text what i'm going to do here is that i'm going to download this file download the, the file here just to show the information okay um, i'm going to to call it blob you can call it any name you know like test so i'm going to save it under the desktop just save it okay now let's go to review this file okay the file is here let me show you. As you can see, it, uh, it's just like a, an XML file with a bunch of attributes and a lot of information here. So this is information is very useful for because it's related to the workflow configuration. And specifically regard that error message that I showed you uh, related to the. Uh, task data type be empty in this case here uh, that error message happens if it's like this start workflow process is new or empty like this one so as you can see this uh, is the configuration file in this case if you need to do some change what you do is that you just edit this file make sure that the information that you have here is the right one then you reinsert it into the database again in that um, binary large object file this one here config data so in summary today you have learned how to see workflow configuration for C repo CO CS config table for master 
data management application. As you could see, it's a binary large object column that you need to download the information and review. Would you love to hear from you? Please get in touch by supportvideos at informatica.com or by Twitter, InfoSupport. Thank you.